right, Candy Wiley. I want to come on here, especially around the holidays, for a special message to everyone. We're only on this earth for a very short time. So let's treat everyone with kindness and compassion and understanding. There's no need to be mean and cruel. You know what, when I see someone's video and I don't like I don't like it, I don't even give it a thumbs down. Right? I just don't watch it. I don't hit the like button, but I don't give it a thumbs down and I don't make crude comments and mean comments. All, uh, all us artists, all we're trying to do is market ourselves, right? That's all we're trying to do. Whether we're musicians or whether we're um, mental health channels or yoga or um, instructional or YouTubers. Um, yeah. That's all we Whatever we're doing, we're just trying our best to get by. You know, you don't know what someone, the pain someone's carrying inside of them. And, you know, they're just trying to put their material out there like, like the rest of us, right? Just trying to get, <laughs> just trying to market ourselves. And, you know, if you don't like it, that's fine. Don't watch it. But you don't have to be mean and cruel. I've had to report several people now here on YouTube that have made derogatory comments, you know? It's like, yeah, if you, if I scroll and I see something I don't like, I just keep scrolling, you know? That's all I do, I keep scrolling. I don't have to make a derogatory com comment, you know? I don't have to, like, purposely go in the person's channel and dislike every one of their videos. <laughs> That's really childish, isn't it? I mean, I can't understand the mentality of some people. Why can't we all be kind, you know? I, I don't understand. Like, you know, I, I'm i trying to make it as much as you're trying to make it, right? And it's hard. I have a severely sick son who's severely brain damaged. Um, I've been through a, a tragic, tragic year of losing someone I love for 16 years who you know, treated me like shit when I needed him the most. My son was brutally beaten, kicked out of his residence, and thrown into like a, um, a, a prison, like a mental ward. I can't explain it. But like, yeah, I'm coming from a, a severe, you know, pain, and I'm trying to put my best foot forward, you know, doing these videos. So if you don't like them, don't watch them. That's all, just scroll, just scroll, but, and that's what I do. You don't have to be cruel. That's the message I'm trying to get out to everyone today is, don't be cruel. Everyone, you know, has their own share of heartache, and we're just trying to get by day to day, you know what I mean? We all have our own, um, what lifts us up, our, our own kind of, like, purpose in life. So, that's what I'm trying to get through to you today and um, just, you know, think twice before you do something. That's the best advice. Think twice. Say to yourself, would I like it if that person, if what I'm doing to someone, would I like it if they did that to me? Would it hurt me? You know, that's what you should ask yourself. Would it hurt me, you know, to make, if someone made that terrible remark, would that hurt me, you know? We're all just trying to, you know, put our own thing, you know, do our own thing, you know, just get through the day. <laughs> That's all, you know. No need to be mean, you know. It's Christmas time. What does that mean to you? You don't have to be religious for it to mean, you know. Just think about Christmas time, you know. Just think about that we're here for a very short time, no matter what you believe, okay. And while we're here... Can't we make it easier on our fellow man? Can't we be kind? Do we have to put people down who are trying their best every single day? Sometimes, like, just to get out of bed is so difficult. 
and to be able to come forth and put a piece of creative material out there for everyone to see or to bear your soul, you know what I mean, and share your most inner demons. You don't need to put people down. You don't need people are just trying to do their best. I'm not hurting anyone, right? So think again before you say something. <laughs> Because I will report you. I have reported people who wrote very derogatory things on my, um, you know. One time I even shut the comments off completely because I was fed up with threats. I completely shut the comments off on my YouTube. And then I'm saying, you know, but that's not fair to everyone else, you know, to shut their, to sh not give them a voice. The people that did nothing wrong, is that right? Shouldn't they be able to say something? Why should I punish everyone? Like a teacher, okay? Don't you hate when the teacher does that? When she says, okay, I don't know who did this, but you all got to stay after school because whoever did it is not, you know, owning up to it. So everyone gets punished. So I thought, do I really want to be that cruel like that teacher? I'm sure you've had one of those teachers, right? If someone doesn't, you know, say who did this, the whole class is going to be punished. And that's not right, so I decided, no, I'm not going to punish the other people, you know, that, so I put the comments back on, but I will report. If you say something, you know, you can say like, well, I mean, you don't have to keep say positive things all the time. You can tell me, you know, this wasn't really a song or, you know, you can say legitimate criticism. I'm not turned off by legitimate criticism. Not at all. You know what I mean? Not at all. Legitimate criticism isn't like, like, you look like a bag lady, your hair is fried, um, you know, that, that's not legitimate criticism, you know, Le legitimate criticism is something like, you know, that, that song really wasn't your song, you know, or, um, you know, something like that, or, you know, contradicting what I say about something, well, I don't think this is true about borderlines, I'm a borderline, and you know, something like that, not something to be mean, it's not something you say to be mean to someone, to hurt someone, to cause someone pain, it's something that you just like want to point out to someone, you know, um, to try to help improve them, that's what legitimate criticism is, it's really not criticism, it's just trying to, you know, give your opinion on a way that might help the person, you know, like, I've got a lot of those too, and that's great. I love that when someone says, "Try to sing that song a little like um, lower keyed. Don't sing it as high pitched because it's coming off, you know, as shrill." Because that person's trying to help me. They're not trying to be mean, you know. They're not trying to cause me pain. They're trying to help me, you know. That's all. You sing like um, country songs better. I'm just trying to think of a legitimate criticism. Or you don't really sing rap as well as you sing pop songs or something like that or you know you know what it is it's not meant to hurt it's meant to inform not hurt inform so that's all I have to say I'll leave you off with this note just be kind be kind all right peace out people